Thank you for participating in Drain the Rain. Drain the Rain is a D.C. Water Clean Rivers project. Drain the Rain is a part of D.C. Water's Clean River project, which is working to reduce combined soil overflows, restore our waterways, and enhance the quality of life here in the district. Your rain barrel helps improve the water quality of Rock Creek. This video has tips to help you maintain and troubleshoot your installed rain barrel. Rain barrels capture and store waters from roof downspouts. It reduces the amount of stormwater runoff going into the combined sewer overflow by capturing rain from your roof by storing it for irrigation and other uses on your property. You can use the spigot on your rain barrel to transfer water to your bucket or to attach a hose. You can use collected water to water plants, gardens and lawns, wash cars, windows, etc. You should not use collected water for drinking or cooking. This water is not for human consumption. If you use moss killer on your roof, do not use water from your barrel to water plants. Keeping your barrel well maintained helps it function well and keeps stormwater out of Rock Creek. Here's some tips how to take care of your rain barrel. Keep the lid closed to prevent algae growth and other animals out. Drain and clean your rain barrel every two to three months to avoid stagnant water, the preferred habitats for bugs and algae. Using the collected water regularly will help with drainage too. When cleaning the inside and outside of your barrel, use a mild dish soap and a brush. Do not use bleach. After cleaning your rain barrel with soap, make sure to thoroughly rinse the soap out before allowing the barrel to refill. Use the collected water regularly between rainstorms to allow more water to be collected during the next storm. This also helps to avoid any issues with overloading the rain barrel. Remember that water is heavy. A full rain barrel could weigh over 400 pounds. For your safety, never attempt to move a rain barrel while it is full. Your rain barrel will be installed level, secure, and safe. If you need to disconnect your rain barrel for winterizing, cleaning, or moving, Make sure that it is empty first and level and stable when reinstalled. Do not let kids or pets play in or on the rain barrel. If you have a concern about your rain barrel, you can troubleshoot the issue. Yes, water will settle in your barrel and the barrel may swell to accommodate it. If water is not flowing into the barrel, you should check the following. As the rain barrel too high relatively to the diverter, water will only fill up to the height of the diverter. Are your downspouts clogged with debris or is your fill hose clogged? If you recently moved your barrel or installed by others, you may need to reposition the barrel or the diverter to ensure positive drainage into the barrel. Remove the diverter by unscrewing the two screws attaching it to the downspout. Then clean the diverter and the downspout by clearing any visible debris. Then reinstall the diverter. If your gutters are regularly clogged, consider installing a filter screen on top of your gutter or downspouts. Remove your hose from the diverter and the barrel. Then remove any debris by using a blunt end rod, such as small broom handle, or by flushing the hose with water. Do not use sharp objects that can tear or damage the hose. If this is occurring while it is raining, have no fear, this is normal. Overflow mainly occurs at the back of the barrel when the fill hole is lower than the diverter. If this occurs, raise the height of the barrel so that the fill hose and the barrel is level with the diverter hole and the downspout. But just remember to be sure the barrel does not sit above the diverter. Thank you for participating in DC Water's Drain the Rain program. If you have any questions, please visit the link below. And thank you again for being a Rock Creek steward.